Okay, it's Lady Jarhead again. It's um, time to do another contest. But um, before I do that, I want to show these. I forgot to do it in my last video. Um, I had a couple people ask me about this mold I was using. I showed it on my other video. The thing I said was a lunchbox. And I found one full size today and then a smaller one. So I forget exactly who it was. There was a couple people that asked me if I could find if another one to grab it for them. So whoever that was, um, I know there was two, at least two people. Let me know. I have two available. This is the, the full size one, which is like the one I have. Uh, I've been making some tiles with this one and then like keychains and magnets and stuff with these. So, but this is the one, this is what it was. It was a classical eco lunch box. And, uh, it works great. It's not shiny on the inside. It's not really dull, but it's not super shiny either. So, you'll have to glaze the piece. But, um, then they had this one, which is this, that size. It just doesn't have the two smaller ones. But that's all they had. So, um, I, I looked. This one wasn't where it should have been. It was on a shelf way away. And I happened to find it. So, if you were one of the people that were asking me about that, just let me know because I have those. Um, then, moving on to the contest. Um, we're going to go quickly through it. It's kind of self-explanatory. Um, you can take it to any level you want. Um, goes far out there as you want with it I mean the only thing I ask is that it's mermaid related mermaid theme that's it with figure skates. <laughs> my daughter said a mermaid with figure skates <laughs> she wanted a figure skating mermaid anyway the she's serious y'all the um contest is mermaids um of course the rules are very simple and few you must be a subby and you of course have to stay sub you can't just sub up for the contest you have to be 18 or older have your parents permission you can only enter one entry not multiples just one entry you can use any materials or mediums that you want in your project I don't care if you use clay resin chalk a potato um you know Anything you want. I just no bodily fluids, please. Um, well, you know, if that's what they want to do it with, that's that's cool with me. I mean, creativity has no limits, except for bodily fluids. I don't want anybody doing any poop art or anything like that. So, anyway, yeah, it's late and we're having fun because we're tired. Anyway. You can only enter one one thing, one design or creation, or, or my daughter said one potato. Um, you can use any material that you want. Did we already cover that? Yeah, we did. Okay, and then I would really appreciate it if you send the item to me. You don't have to. It's not a requirement, but it would be greatly appreciated. And... You got to have fun with it and enjoy it. It's it's not to be cutthroat or anything like that. It's for fun. So, it's pretty, pretty clear. I mean, like I said, it's take it any way you want as far as how you want to do the mermaid or the theme or whatever. I just like the mermaid theme. I love mermaids. So, anything to do with mermaids would be great. And these are the prizes. Um, I guess I'll start with this. One of those, um, collapsible lunch boxes. So, you can use it as a lunch box. Or you can use it as a mold. I personally use them as mold. But, um, it hasn't been used. The bag just came, the sticky came off. Anyway. There's that. Then there's this cupcake keychain. Ah, cupcake keychain. La la la. Cupcake 
keychain that I made. So, little um, cupcake there. And then um, the pack of the um, Recollection Glitters. This um, clay mold. Never been used. Um, it is clay mold, but I have used these type of molds for resin in the past, and they work. So um, you could use it for either or. It's the, um, um, I guess that's a macaroon. Or, nope, it's ice cream scoops. Duh. Ice cream scoops there. And like a bagel thingy here. And then the roll top. So, that's what it makes. So it is, there is a macaroon and then there's ice cream scoop and then there's that type of roll. I don't know what it's called, but I'm sure, I'm sure y'all know. So there's that mold. And then there's a box of never used, um, amazing mold putty. It's the, um two-thirds pound box 300 grams there's that then there's some deco din deco dinning um pieces there's this waffle cone bowl thing and it's soft like rubber for deco dinning then there's this tart base it is hard it's not rubbery there's that. Then there is this. Um, again, that's I think it's the same thing as that. That some type of roll. And this is um, rubbery too. It's not as flexible as that, but it is kind of rubbery. And then there's the waffle cone itself. And it's very flexible. Very rubbery. Okay. So there's those four things. Then there's a um, remit. Hello Kitty. It's the waffle cone with the Hello Kitty in it. It has not been opened. It's sealed. Then there is a pack of Rilakkuma stickers. Brand new, never been opened. Pack of these decorations, fabric accent decorations, some ice cream scoops and popsicles and goodies, some more popsicles and goodies. Then there's these um, decorative Hello Kitties, Sanrio. Will you dress her up? Okay, and then there's these Twin Star stickers. So. And then there's these um, Hello Kitty stickers. And then there's these cute little stickers. The Paris theme. Those are really nice. Um, that's all those and then there is this now I have not opened it this thing the glue came loose so it's kind of like hanging right there but I have not opened it pulled anything out or it's got the wiring still, you know, wrapped and holding it in place. But I got this when I went on that haul with Kat in San Antonio. When we went to the river walk or whatever that was. Went shopping, went to the San Rio store. And I got this specifically to, to have with my next contest. So, it's the Toki Doki Hello Kitty. And it has her. speaking and it has the two penguins. They're really cute. So... Those are the um, prizes you can win for the contest for um, first place. 
So, and what I'm going to do with this contest is I'm just going to have a first place. Um, well, I guess I can do first, second, and third. But second and third, um, whoever plays second, third, they'll get a prize too. I just don't have something to show you right now. But trust me, it'll be a decent prize. And then also what I do, if um, you're not familiar with my contest, is regardless if you place first, second, third, or fourth, fifth, sixth, whatever, first, second, third get prizes like these. Um, of course, first getting the most, second getting the next most, and third getting the least. Um, as far as, you know, the first place winner gets more items in their prize package. Put it that way. Um, but everybody who participates in the contest gets something from me in appreciation for um, contributing to the contest. So it's not a lot. It's not, you know, in high value or anything. It's just a little thank you, basically, for entering my contest. So... Regardless, if you place first, second, or third, you will get something for um, participating. So, um, the contest will officially start, um, of course, now. Um, and I am going to end the contest February 22nd. So... We have uh, till February 22nd to get your um, contest entries in, and you um, must do a video response to this video when you show your mermaid themed creation. Um, there is not going to be exceptions to that. I'm sorry, but it's not fair to anybody else who does theirs if there's not. You know, if you're included into the contest without having done your video response. So, please, um, if you don't know how to do a video response, um, type in how do you do a video response. And there'll be plenty of tutorials on YouTube. That's how I learned. Um, so, please make sure, you, you know, you, you, you figure out how to do that because a video response has, is mandatory. It has to be done. And um, I hope everybody has fun with it and enjoys it. And I hope I have um, several entries, definitely enough entries to make it worthwhile. So um, y'all have a great night. I look forward to seeing everybody's entry and um, have fun with it. Bye.